Okay, just about to get underway here. Some Saturday afternoon hockey with your Littleton Hawks against the Heritage Eagles Junior Varsity Squad. Looks like they've got a full bench today. 32 skaters for the uh, Eagles. They are obviously the ones wearing red. Um, your starting lineup for the Hawks looks like we got Oliver Daly. Derek Castro and Bo Curran up front. Aiden McGinty and Alex Siegel on defense. Let's go, Hawks. Hawks sending it in and chase. Curran chips it up and over the glass for an early whistle. Castro goes in for the faceoff. Daly now fighting for it. Comes across. Siegel tries to hold it on the line. Picked away by Burkhart. Taking the reins in net this afternoon. Ben Burkhart making that first save. McGinty sends it up off of Daly's leg. Daly then chips it up out through the neutral zone. Curran got a piece of it. Let's Daly retrieve the puck back to Curran. Curran now sends it in. Gloved but not controlled. Bunger comes onto the ice. Roebuck comes in and helps. Keeps it in the zone. Roebuck now in the corner. Roebuck trying to bring it out front. Comes all the way and hits again. Walshaw now on defense. Walshaw... Goes down to pick it up here. All the way across trying to feed Baker. Baker now circles with it. Drops it to Walshaw. Walshaw slings it over to Roebuck. Hitzig steps into it and sends it down low. No one's there on the close side. Bounce over Walshaw's stick. Juan plays it through center. Hitzig regroups, gets a pass over to Castro. Siegel, good job sealing off the play, not letting a decent shot get anywhere near net. Menzies picks it up, sends it down. So Menzies, Juan, Castro now out. Castro trying to get to it as Juan sent it around, but I'm not sure. Look like it's been played with a high stick. So that will just give us a whistle and a faceoff. See Menzies to the left. Juan along the wall with Siegel. McGinty at that center point. Castro and Juan. Juan trying to get to it. Says it down that Siegel can get there. Now back to Juan. Trying to feed it down to Castro. Menzies now comes across. Siegel tries to wind it up through the neutral zone. 
sends it in, comes back out. Castro sends it in. Hawks will change here. I can see Curran and Daly hopping on. Hopping on. Curran now first on the four check. Daly helps keep it in the zone there. Now Daly will chase. Bunger joins. Curran now circles with a little bit of space here. Curran with a nice pass trying to feed Bunger right in the slot. Fed back in. They uh, whistle that for a hand pass, so that'll get us a whistle and a line change. Hitzig and Walsh out on defense. Castro, Roebuck, and Baker out front. Hawks are doing a little bit of a short bench today, so we'll call the lines as we see them. Baker tries to come across, get it along the wall. Now... Roebuck picked it up, sent it down low. Baker now trying to get over to him. Picked up through center by Roebuck. He's got a little bit of space. Shrugs off the check and the slash. Now sent along. Now Baker with it behind the net. He reverses, sends it out front. Castro fighting for the bouncing puck. Sent down and around, swung at and missed by... Baker, but a nice setup from Roebuck. Walshaw throws it off the Heritage player's face mask. Trying to keep it in. Sent down on the far side of the red line, so that'll be an icing call. Hawks were changing, so let's see. Bunger, Juan, and Menzies out with Siegel and McGinty. Bunger to take the face off. Juan tries to get a piece of it. Menzies with no stick tries to get back to his lumber. Quick love save by Ben Burkhardt. So I'm sure the camera didn't see that. Shot goes through some skates and legs. Menzies trying to send it up and out. Now McGinty helping. Back check from Juan playing, but trying to play it out to Bunger. Comes back into the zone here. 11.05 to go here in the first period. Siegel. Tries to send a pass intercepted, glove down. Bunger plays the body. Now Juan trying to get it along the wall, still not out. McGinty pulls it to the corner, sends it up, still not out. Juan throws a nice check right in front of the Hawks bench. He'll go off on a change. Siegel now with it, trying to keep some space. Bounces over the heritage stick, so Hawks able to complete the change. Walshaw comes across. Now Daly trying to get a piece of it. Hitzig scoops it up behind the net, reverses back to Walshaw. Stick by Curran to get a piece of it. Now Walshaw playing it into the close corner. Castro picks it up. Castro sends it around to Curran. Just missed him trying to get that outlet feed. Daly now trying to get it out. Burkhardt kicks it away. Deflects and change directions and still goes wide on the glove side there. Tipped out by the Heritage player out front. 
Finally, at least comes out through the neutral zone for a second. Walshaw now with it. Castro trying to feed Baker on the far side. Still kept in there. Singing. So Bunger, Baker, Roebuck all now out. <laughs> Siegel trying to control through the through center, sends it in. Siegel, nice job. He kicks it over to McGinty. Sent into the corner. Nice defensive play there. Siegel sent it to the behind the net. Nice play, good save by Ben Burkhart. But able to find that shot that was incoming, grab that before there was any real rebound. Juan Menzies Castro out with Walshaw and Hitzig. 8.08 here in the first. Ship to the wall by Juan. He gets it up and out of the zone. Walshaw throws a hit there in the neutral zone, trying to get to the puck. Juan circles with it, throws it off the glass. Castro gloves it down to himself. Castro with it. He's got Juan and Menzies out front. Shot goes deflecting off the goalie up into the netting. 7.41 7.41 to go here in the first. Bunger, Curran, Roebuck out front with Hitzig and Walshaw. Hitzig trying to get to the puck behind, sends it up into the netting. Not a penalty at this age. So, 7.27 to go here. First period, let's see. Siegel and McGinty now out with Bunger, Curran, and, Ro- and Roebuck. McGinty slings it around, trying to feed it to Roebuck. Trying to make that set play happen and just couldn't force it into the zone. Hawks will regroup here. McGinty. Curran combined in the corner. Curran takes a shot, but that'll draw a penalty. So uh, seven minutes to go here in the first. Looks like the Hawks are going on their first power play. So let's see. Daly, Castro, and Curran up front with Hitzig and Juan on the points to start this power play. Castro wins it back. Feathered out to Juan at the point. (laughs) Sent in deep. Castro will retrieve. Juan fed it over to Curran. Kicked in, but that'll be offsides. And I guess in this game, they're doing delayed offsides, which at least the Hawks team's not used to. But I'm sure they understand the concept. Castro now has it. Juan now with it. He's got Daly 
Baker trailing out to Baker. Baker gets a shot. The trickle's in. One minute, one second to go here in the power play. Bunger, Menzies, Baker, Siegel, McGinty. Menzies will take this face off. Baker feeds it out to Siegel. Down the wall, Menzies and Bunger try to get to it, but Baker retrieves it along the wall. Siegel back to Baker. Five seconds to go here in the power play. McGinty picks it up and walks out of the Hawks zone, circles back with it, trying to get the cycle set. Good play by Siegel. Playing out to the outside. That'll be a penalty. Bunger has it through center. Chipped out front. Nice play there by the Hawks, and that was all on a delayed penalty on the Eagles. So just as the penalty expired, the Hawks will go right back on the power play. Or just math in general, but... Okay, so 4.58 to go here in the first period. Hawks back on the power play. Juan has it on the point and walks. Sends it along to Daly in the corner. Down to Curran, back up to Daly. Juan now walks with it over to Curran, back to Juan with a one-timer. Castro tries to get a piece of it, gives it to Daly. Daly, Curran, rebound went straight up and out. Hawks working here. Curran now Juan walks out with it. Juan, nice pass across. Followed up by Hitzig on the follow-up. Got his own rebound to get the goal. So Connor Hitzig will be credited with that goal. Juan with a great pass across. And goalie made a nice save on the first attempt and then Went right back onto Hitzig stick for the goal. So, all right, with 4.18 to go here in the first period, that will be a power play goal for the Hawks. Bunger, Baker, Roebuck. Hitzig now with an extra step with that goal a second ago. Roebuck with it in the corner. Baker going in to help out. Bunger trying to poke it out. Baker with it. Baker circles. Bunger intercepted. First pass. Now chipped in on sides. Walshaw. Bunger chases as the Hawks are in a change here. McGinty, now Castro and Bunger all combined to try to get to that puck. 3-10 to go here. Shot gets deflected. <laughs> Menzies grabs it through the neutral zone and walks in. He's got Castro streaking in far side. Juan out top. Juan has it. Juan chips with the backhand out front. Juan pulls it back to himself. Juan shoots. Don't know if it went off the glove or else just missed. Body's flying. Juan 
Now Castro with it. Castro takes a shove into the corner, but Juan sends it out front. Menzies trying to track it down. It'll be iced here by Heritage. Two twenty to go here in the first. Bunger, Daly, Curran out with Siegel and McGinty. <coughs> McGinty chases it to the corner. Bad save, another good save by Burkhardt off the blocker. Curran now with it. Bunger pushes it down low. Now Daly coming to help. Siegel comes along the wall to try to keep it in. Bunger grabs it. Bunger shot, glove save. Right at the wall by Walshaw. Walshaw throws the body. The player right at the Hawks bench. That looks to be a penalty. So a minute 30 to go here in the first period. Hawks will find themselves shorthanded here for the first time. This game. Two minute roughing call. <laughs> Penalty killers, Siegel and Walshaw. No, I'm sorry, scratch that. Siegel and Hitzig out with Juan and Menzies. Oh, streaking across play that did not connect. Up into the Hawks bench. Stay alert out there, Hawks coaches. Wanted to take this face off. Siegel and Hitze combine and keep pushing that puck out. Shot goes wide around. Fifty seconds to go in the period. Minute nineteen to go in the power play. Shipping puck dropped down. Juan dropped it. Chipped out by Hitzig. Take that whistle and get ourselves some fresh skaters. That'll be Castro, Roebuck, McGinty, and Daly. McGinty with it here. Wraps it around, not out. Castro gets a good piece of it. Robot, good one on one battle, trying to get down to that puck. Back out through center. Eight seconds to go here in the period. 35 to go here in the kill. <laughs> Daly is going to come with the puck here. Uh, no, uh, hits it. No, oh, that's right, hits it. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, something like that. High school rules apply. They might not Zam and JP at all. I'm not sure. They should. The high school rule is not 
Yeah, there's something about the flow of the game that it helps a little bit. There's a reason for it. Yeah. Especially the delayed offsides. To me, there's been like so many whistles in our league for the for just the odd constant offsides. And at this age, you should be ringing a kid's neck that's offsides. Yeah. That's insane. They shouldn't be doing it when they're 16. <laughs> Yeah, there's that. Do they even call off sides in like squirt? They do. Okay, we're going to start the second period. Hawks still have uh, 30 seconds to go on this kill. Uh, starting to work on this kill will be Castro and Daly out with Siegel and McGinty. Ben Burkhardt still holding it down in net here to start the second period. Daly wraps it around, sends it in. I'm playing high school rules today, so Hawks able to dump and chase here shorthanded. Delayed off sides, the whole shebang. Nice pick by Castro, sends the puck back in. 11 seconds to go in this kill. McGinty comes over to pick up the skater. He gets the puck in the corner, slings it over to Castro. Pucks back to full strength, says the stick of the Heritage goalie. Curran grabs it and skates into it, sends it back around close side. McGinty and Daly. Curran gets a piece of it, lets Castro get to it. Castro sent it out, trying to feed Curran back. Juan trying to get a piece of it now. Walshaw comes over and helps out. Walshaw puts the player into the boards. Juan skates away with it. Juan slaws a step, chips it over to Bunger, over to Curran. Curran. Good play. Menzies picks it up. Bunger chips at it. Bunger now won over to Menzies. Menzies gets a piece. Bunger. Juan dances the blue line. Keeps it in momentarily. Comes out through center now. 13.55 to go here. Menzies trying to control it, feeding out front. The play by Hitzig to get to that puck. Walshaw recovers. Now Hitzig with it. Hitzig looks to advance it. Up to Bunger. Bunger chips off of his stick. It's redirected all the way down. That will be a nice in call. So 13.24 to go here in the second period. Castro, Baker, Roebuck out with McGinty and Siegel. Roebuck chases it down behind the net, stays on the player. Goes off of Castro, skated up and out of the zone. But McGinty will recover it. Break out to Roebuck over to Baker. Baker slings it to McGinty. McGinty's shot goes off the leg of a heritage player. Good stick by Roebuck. Now penalty called on heritage. That'll be a hooking call. So 12.55 to go here in the second. Hold at Roebuck one too many times. 
drew the penalty. Did Roebuck. Nice play there. So Hawks will go on the power play here. Curran, Castro, Daly, Juan, and Hitzig. Another penalty called here. So... It's a penalty for his stick being right by his neck. It's a penalty for the stick being right by the neck. I don't, I don't know what they, what the signal for that is, but it's pretty clear. It's pretty clear that's where Mr. Curran's stick was at the time. So we'll skate four on four for a minute forty-six. Twelve forty-one to go here in the second. Castro, Daly, Siegel, and Hitzig are your four Hawks skaters. Castro and Daly trying to get to it. Castro with it along the wall. Sent all the way down. So that'll be an icing call. They'll make a line change here, though, and that'll bring out Roebuck, Bunger, McGinty. And uh, Siegel out there as well. For your four Hawks, again, skating four on four for another minute 19. Barring any unforeseen penalties, Bunger sends it to the wall. McGinty sends it over to Siegel. Bunger sends it in. Roebuck trying to get to it. Roebuck will. Give it, Joey. Siegel able to keep it in. McGinty. Roebuck, Roebuck. Now Bunger comes up with it. Oh, nice pass, buddy. Bunger feeding Siegel on that far side. Trying to connect that. Angry ref, much? I don't know. It seems like there's a lot of education going on in the ice. That's what I like to see on Saturday. It's keeping it real out there. <laughs> Menzies, Baker out with Walshaw and Hitzig. Walshaw with it, turns to shoot. Sends it down to Menzies. Walshaw got a piece of it. Good save by Ben Burkhart. Hawks are doing a nice job collapsing down onto the puck. Burkhart did the job he is assigned to, saving that puck, not letting, not letting go into the net. Still nine seconds to go in this four on four. sends it in on the chase. Menzies gets a piece of it. Menzies sends it back in. Now back to even strength. Hits it, picks it up through the neutral zone, forces it in. Juan gets a piece of it. Sends it in deep. 10 minutes, 30 to go. Here in the second. Curran keeps it in at the line and sends it back in deep. Daly sends it around. McGinty will be first to it. Tried to chip it out to McGinty. That pass was intercepted and iced by Heritage. 
9.56 to go here in the second. Castro, Curran, Daly out with McGinty and Siegel. Goes off the side of the net. Played out by Curran. I'm sorry, by Castro. Trying to feed it out front to Daly. Siegel, nice job coming up with the puck there. Puck chipped out behind the net. McGinty sends it over to Curran. Curran chips it up and out. Hawks. Siegel now controls. Gives it over to McGinty. Ginty, hard pass back to Siegel. Castro's able to skate into this one. He's got Curran with him. Oh! Nice Fed out front. He's not able to connect that last dot, but another good looking play for the Hawks. It's in a lot of nice chances today so far for the Hawks. Bunger, Baker, Roebuck out front with Hitzig and Walshaw. Let's go, Hawks. You know, it's when you use the water, it's like glue. It's just it's this amazing substance that always holds the net into place. Pandemic in suburbia. Hitzig has to chase that puck down. Roebuck gets a piece of it. Played by the Heritage team, so Hawks keep it in play here. Walshaw sends it in deep. Hawks chase. Bunger now. Baker. Hitzig shot goes just wide on the glove side. Sticked away by the goalie. Baker chips it down to Bunger. Bunger kicks it to the corner. Menzies, Juan, Castro out. McGinty chips it over to Siegel. Back to McGinty. 7.52 to go here in the second. Hawks get it out. Can't find it in the neutral zone. Sent back in on Burkhart. Picked up by McGinty. Dente's shaking off a couple of the Heritage players, trying to get it out. That looked like that. Sorry to hold my breath there, but the way that changed direction from Siegel grabbing it. Thought it almost went in. Here comes Max Menzies attacking. There, slips around the one player. Backhand chips straight up into the air. He tries to glove it to himself. Castro working hard down low. Menzies and Daly along the wall. Menzies to Castro. Castro, he was calling for it. Got the shot right on. Bounces over everything, but Curran will grab it. McGinty sends it in deep. Daly. First on the chase, Daly gets a piece of it there. Daly, Curran, Bunger out with Walshaw, hits it. Hits it, comes up with it down low. Walshaw, breakout pass to Curran.
Shipped out through the neutral zone here. Walshaw forcing to the outside. Walshaw, no lumber. Walshaw still without a stick. Throws a nice check. Walshaw able to skate over and get his stick here. Five ten to go here in the second. Hawks getting a little bit stuck in their zone here. Bunger now gets a pass out there to Daly. Daly will send it in. Hawks needed that change. Juan Baker Roebuck. Juan gets that nice pass through center. Burkhardt sets it up for McGinty. McGinty skates it, throws it off the wall. Right to a heritage player. Good save by Burkhardt. Siegel sends it up the, up the wall. Siegel goes now far side trying to get it to Roebuck and out. Siegel will just ice the puck with 4.18 to go in the second period. Roebuck, Baker, Castro out with Walshaw. And Hitzig. Castro tries to play it off the wall. Comes out of the zone. Castro with it, but whistle behind the play. I mean, an interference call. It's a plead in his case, but he'll do it from the penalty box. 3.56 to go here in the second. Hawks need to kill this penalty here. Bunger, Menzies, McGinty, and Siegel. Siegel with it. Feeds it out. Menzies. Shorthanded goal by Max Menzies, able to get to that puck that was bobbled by the Heritage player. Make the most of that shorthanded strike. So 3.45 to go here in the second period. Still a minute 49 to go in this kill. This group of four will stay out. <laughs> Sent in from center ice by by McGinty, and that's another goal. McGinty just sending it in. All right, so two quick goals by the Hawks, both short-handed. Now we lead 3-0. McGinty goes over to chase that puck down. Juan trying to get to it. So a minute 25 to go. The Hawks being short-handed. Seem to be a benefit for him so far, scoring two goals during this penalty kill so far. Shot goes off a leg to the corner. Siegel sends it up the wall. Daly sends it off the linesman and up into the netting.
Juan, Daly, McGinty, and Walshaw. All your four skaters. Juan now challenging. Hawks got some sticks on it. That was Daly. He'll send it on net. Sorry, I got to make sure you get that. You never know when one of those is going to go in, apparently. Daly trying to get a piece of it along the short wall. Shot goes up and over. So the Heritage player was streaking in. One time shot. Also deflected and went wide. Nice read there. Baker sends a shot on net. Baker just fresh off the bench. Able to get that puck from Walshaw and rifle it on net. Nine seconds to go in this kill for the Hawks. Castro and Baker out front with Walshaw and Siegel. Under two minutes to play here in the second. Hawks now back to full strength. Curran joins the fray. Sent ahead trying to feed Baker. Signing on far side of the red line, so that'll be an icing. Minute 36 to go. Bunter will join Curran and Baker out front. Siegel and McGinty on D. Glove down by Burkhart. McGinty slips the check, keeps the puck, keeps it again as he wheels. Sends it over to Siegel. Siegel now reverses. Siegel now with a little bit of room. Feeds out to Curran with a nice pass. <laughs> nice goal by Bo Curran. Coming in. Out comes Castro, Menzies, and Roebuck. Minute 13 to go here in the second. Menzies will take the face off. Roebuck sends a shot right off the goalie. out by Castro back through center after some good defensive work by the Hawks. 35 seconds to go here, second period. Just the, ch the chirping is ongoing there on ice. Two of our players ran into each other, and the Heritage guy's like, nice hit. And then, they, then, uh, then our guy said something back to them about. Harmless shot comes in behind the net. Siegel, final on the half boards. Tried to be fed out to one. Now Kat, uh, Curran picks it up. Curran. Shot glove save. Just seven seconds to go. go 
Daily Curran and Juan out front. Five seconds to go. Okay, so after two periods, Hawks really stretched that lead. Don't seem to be. So it's like we'll be uh, doing the Zamboni either. So no break for the Hawks. See if that affects them at all. They're used to sitting around for a few minutes middle of the game. Eating orange slices or something. <laughs> Okay, let's see here. Starting the third period. Hoss controlling the puck, controlling the lead. Juan, Roebuck, Baker out front with Walshaw and Hitzig. It's a nice pass over to Baker. Baker pass chipped out by Juan, sent in. Juan got a piece, so he gets it over to Baker. Baker to Walshaw. Roebuck chips at it. Now Baker gives it to Juan. That was going to be a nice setup. Walshaw has the puck here. Walshaw to Baker. Over to Roebuck. Far pass to Daly. Daly now walks, tries to feed it to Castro. Chips at down low, McGinty. Heritage players able to chip at it. Not much more. Curran now with it. Daly grabs it. Now Bunger jumps on. Bunger now chases it to the corner. Curran will come up with it and send it in. Bunger, Juan, and Menzies now out together. Menzies with it along the wall, feeds it out to, to hits it, hits it with a shot, tipped out by Juan out front, froze by the goalie. 13.37 to go here in the third. It's been all hawk so far. Bunger and Hitzig talking it over. Juan to the right, Menzies to the left, Walshaw hanging out there at the blue line. Love that, then over the net. Juan throwing the body into the boards. 
Menzies trying to get a piece of it. Juan throwing it again. Menzies and Juan working along the wall. Menzies still with it. Juan turns, tries to get the shot. Menzies picks it up behind the net, reverses. Juan now with it. It's a trying to keep it in along the wall. Juan down to Bunger. Bunger now with it. Cycles it to Juan. Walshaw sends it right back in. See Juan going off on a change. Bunger goes deep, gets a piece of that puck. Good save by Burkhart. Until it's 12.06 to go. He should get his belt right for swinging on our goal. Yeah. Well after the whistle. Yeah, chopping at the goalie way after the bell. So 12.06 to go, third period. have two players in the box here. Looks like that's going to be a, kind of too intense. Oh, it takes sends a puck out. So regardless, Hawks are shorthanded here for two minutes. 11.55 to go here in the game. And the Hawks have a couple of shorthanded tallies already. Shot by Baker as the Heritage is trying to get their shot. Shot goes off a leg. Comes down low. McGinty now hits it. McGinty goes full into the back of the net. McGinty now and hits it. Hits it trying to pin it along the boards. Castro. Goes off of another body and goes behind the net. Castro can get it here along the wall. And sends it up and out. Saying no icing there. Minute three to go in the kill. McGinty blows a tire right out in front of the Hawks bench. Maybe he's too busy Snapchatting. <laughs> oh, Menzies here on the forecheck is going to get a hold of the puck here. Good little individual effort trying to get onto his forehand while he's got red jerseys falling all over the place around him. Menzies still with it. Now looks for some support. 22 to go in this kill. Great way to kill the penalties. Controlling that puck. 
Menzies almost poked it again right there. Now Juan will. Juan will send it in. Now Menzies skating it down to get a piece of it. Okay, back to even strength. That's the way to kill a penalty. Daly has it, sends it down low. Roebuck joins. As does Baker from the bench. Baker streaking in, trying to get around the player. Good job keeping it in by Oliver Daly. Daly again keeping it in on the close side. Roebuck trying to find it in skates. Baker sending a shot, trying to get a piece of it. Now Bunger trying to get a piece of it. Bunger feeding that pass out to Baker. Guess is that. So Bunger also drawing a penalty on that play as the Heritage player goes to the box for a hooking call. So 9.20 to go. Bunger coming uh, right back out with Castro and Curran. Juan and Hitzig on the points. Hitzig with it. Hitzig hard pass over to Juan now with it over to Bunger. Bunger down low to Curran. Curran sets up shot. Feeds it to... Oh, went off the outside on the outside of the net. That was a great looking play. Bunger feeds it out to Castro. Castro around one player. Backhands it over to Curran. Curran just shoves the player away and up to Hitzig. Castro turns right back in with it. Kern walked into that one, got a hard shot. Coming all the way back down. Bunger feeds it over to Castro. Back to Bunger. Juan gets that. Juan stays with it. He's got Menzies and Hitzig down low with him. Huxley shorthand for another 22 seconds here. Hitzig. Daly gets a piece of it. It along the wall now. Baker's gonna get it here, walking into the zone. Players are changing. Seven minutes to play here in the third. McGinty sends it up to Menzies. That'll be no icing as the puck's played here. Castro gets a piece of it, sends it in deep. Castro and Roebuck. Roebuck with it. Drops it back to Castro. 6.22 to go. Roebuck now. Castro's trying to stay with it. Signaled for icing. So 6.05. Third period. (laughs) 
Castro, Curran, and Juan out with Daly and Hitzig. An offensive zone opportunity here. Daly working hard along the wall. Daly over to Juan. Curran trying to find it in the neutral zone. Comes in off sides. Castro, Juan, and Curran still out there. Daly. Pass across to Juan. Juan loses his lumber, but Bunger gets a piece of it, sends it down along the wall. Now chipped up and over everything for icing. Now waved off. Hitzig spins it up. Versus Walshaw. Bunger comes in and gets a piece of it out to Baker. Walshaw sends it in deep. Baker first on the chase. Menzies gets a piece of it. McGinty chips it along the wall. Over to Bunger. Walshaw plays it back to McGinty. Back to Walshaw. Baker out to Menzies. Menzies stays after it. Menzies still with it. No one else out there as Hawks were changing. Now Curran and Daly come in. Puck still stays in. Menzies and Daly working along the wall. Curran now looks to have it. He slips the check still with the puck. Backhands it on net. Three thirty to go here, third period. So Castro, Curran, and Roebuck up front with Daly and Hitzig on the points. Daly sends it up. Roebuck sends it up out of the zone. Castro chips it out ahead to Curran. Can't be held in at the blue line, so we another whistle with 3.07 to go. And out come Juan, Bunger, and Baker. Along with McGinty and Walsh also. Five fresh skaters. Shot That's the only thing I know about Saved by the goalie. <laughs> I think it gets out in a minute. No, that's what that's what they were yelling about. I think he's done. I think he's basically done. So towards the net, Baker gets a piece of it. Bunger brings it in. He's got Juan with him. He shakes off a check. Chips it to Juan in the corner. Feeds it out to McGinty for a blast. Goes off of somebody. Walshaw trying to hold it in at the wall. 
Bunger sends it right back in deep. 2.09 to go. It's him trying to slip around the player. Juan. Frozen by Burkhart. Baker took exception to the extra slash at Burkhart as they were rushing in on net there. Then at 49 to go. Love saved by Burkhart. I think that would have gone way over the net, but still saved. Good glove save. Minute forty to go here. Sent around Curran. Slowed down by the snow in front of the Hawks bench. Curran and Menzies. Menzies now on the attack. Daly trying to control the puck in the wall. Menzies sends it. Castro trying to get a piece of it. 55 seconds to play. Curran will chase it down into the corner. Last rush here, 30 seconds to go. Intercepted, Curran now with it. Curran sent it on net. Menzies battling down low, Walshaw. Is off the blocker, 10 seconds to play here. Robuck with a shot at the buzzer goes right through the blue paint. That'll be the game, folks. Reasonably one-sided affair. We'll take it for Saturday afternoon hockey. Hawks playing with a short bench. Played really well. Obviously working on their cycling and their breakout very well. Okay, well, thanks for joining us, Ox fans.